before anything else, we would like to extend our warmest welcome to our dean, faculty, and staff of the RPC. And also, we would like to acknowledge Dr. Mary Castro and Dr. Asumta Calano. Okay, so I think everyone's ready. So let's start our program today. Time check, 1.06 p.m. Okay, so now as we start this event, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Kyrie Shane Aragon, your moderator for today's virtual acquaintance. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the first ever RPC virtual acquaintance, A Glimpse of the New Faces. To formally start our program, may I request Edmar Gabriel, the Vice Governor of RPC Student Council, to lead the Lasallian Prayer. Let us all remember that we are in the most holy presence of the Lord. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear God, we thank you for this week. We offer you our works, joy, and challenges. We thank you for the blessing us with the gift of life. We humbly ask you to lead our ways to be a pioneer, inflame our hearts with compassion, enrich our lives with service, and enlighten us with truth. Guide us in every decision and conversation and fill our hearts with love and grace. Our Lasallian prayer, I will continue, O oh my God, to do all my actions for the love of you. Saint John the Baptist de, La de La Salle, pray for us. Live Jesus in our hearts forever. Amen. Let us also stand and give respect for the Philippine flag as we sing our national anthem. Mga kababayan, ang pambansang awit ng Pilipinas. At this point, Sir Rene Toquero, the advisor of the RPC department, will deliver his opening remarks. Let's all give him a virtual clap, please. Okay, thank you so much for un unmuting. Okay, so uh, good afternoon, Pan Pacifics. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay. Good afternoon, sir. From New Padilla School of Education and Arts Scholars. So uh, welcome to this uh, momentous uh, activity for us. I hope that we're going to enjoy this uh, moment and. Uh, Let's, okay, with this activity, a glimpse of uh, new faces, especially to the first years, welcome to uh, Pan Pacific University, and of course, welcome to RPC, and uh, let's uh, 
greet and meet. I hope that all of us will enjoy this uh, moment. Welcome and good afternoon. Okay, thank you so much, Sir Reneto Quero. And now, let's all watch a short video about Pan Pacific University prepared by the RPC Student Council. A 25-year legacy tempered by four core values. That is what guides Pan Pacific University in its pursuit of continued excellence. The university is devoted to building better lives by pioneering in learning, teaching, and research. Compassionate towards the environment and our fellow men, service-oriented in our processes, and to pursue truth for the benefit of humanity. Pan Pacific University stands poised to continue the spirit of pioneering set by its founding father, Dr. Romeo T. Padilla, who helped elevate the college to a university in just 14 years. This value sets to guide the Pan Pacific University to be a school for leaders. To innovate not only its education programs, but to encourage its members to become innovators themselves. This thirst for knowledge, fostered by a sense of creativity, pushes faculty, staff, and students to excel not only in these halls, but everywhere our opportunities take us as well. Pioneers in every sense of the word, poised and ready for a more global climate. Pan Pacific University stands ready to foster and spearhead techniques, innovations, and people to remain true to the spirit of its legacy and pave the way for a whole new generation of teachers and students guided by its values. Pan Pacific University, the total university. Amidst pandemic and being stuck in our homes, made us more innovative. Everything is changing. The rapid growth and use of technology, particularly by young people, has a significant impact on education, forcing educators and schools to examine their students' changing learning patterns and requirements. Creativity and innovation in education are no longer a luxury, but a need. Even in our darkest times, we can see a light that will make everything possible. That even though there is no assurance that life before will be back. Being innovative is beyond what we expected.
Thank you so much for that amazing video. And now, let's also watch another video prepared by the RPC Student Council and also a presentation introducing the faculty members. Mabuhay, Pan Pacific University. Mabuhay, Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts. I would like to extend my cordial greetings to everyone, especially to our incoming freshman students. When the door of Pan Pacific University opens to everyone, I would like to tell you that you made the right choice. You are the shelter that will provide you quality education amidst the pandemic that we are facing right now. Future educators, welcome to Pan Pacific University. Good morning, RPC students. First and foremost, I would like to congratulate everyone for trying our best to continue our education in spite of the challenging setup of online classes in the midst of pandemic. I know this new mode of learning is very challenging for everyone, but our determination to succeed in life is our biggest weapon. That's why we survive in the academic year 2020 2021. So as we begin another academic year, keep striving for the best because I know and I believe you can. And let us inculcate to our mind that everything we do will be worth it. To our freshmen, welcome to your second home. Welcome to Pan Pacific University. Keep safe and sound always. I hope to see everyone personally soon. May God bless us all. Hello everyone, my name is Carrie Shane Aragon, your secretary from the RPC department. I would like to say thank you for being here with us today and also thank you for choosing Pan Pacific University. All of us have been through a lot this year because we've all faced different challenges. But still, let's try to be more positive. Even though that we are having online classes, let's try to give our best, grab every opportunity, and also, try to develop the capacity to adopt and learn the important learnings that can be useful in our daily lives. That would be all. Stay safe, everyone. Hola, I am Eric Miko, currently studying at Penn Pacific University, Philippines. In this time of pandemic, we saw the power of technology. Even in times like this, we can learn a lot just like how we learn in face-to-face -face classes. I am also grateful to Penn Pacific University for the chances it provides me and for its unwavering support in helping me in achieving my goals. Again, this is Eric Wiko. Thank you. Good day. I'm glad to welcome you all here in Pan Pacific University, wherein you can experience a total university. I'm hoping that you will enjoy your college journey and hope to spend time with you all soon. As a third year student, I must say that it is not easy, but through the help of the school and staff, I am coping up with the new normal and get to experience it with enjoyment. Good day everyone, my name is Abigail Joy Alfan, AB Psychology student and your third year representative. On behalf of all third year students, welcome to Pan Pacific University 
and welcome to Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts. Enjoy and have a great day. Hello Pan Pacifics, I am Beverly C. Tabilin, Bachelor of Elementary Education, your second year representative. I'd want to give a warm welcome to all of you as we begin another academic year. And as you begin a wonderful journey of discovery, we are happy to be your educational partner. Again, welcome and enjoy the rest of the virtual party. Hello everyone, I'm Mike Lawrence Miran Karahay, your first year representative for this academic year. And I, together with RPC Student Council, would like to welcome you all my fellow freshmen to Pan Pacific University. Stay safe and God bless. Okay, so we would like to insert also Dr. Mary Castro and Dr. Asumta Kalano as one of our faculty members of the RPC. Okay, so I know everyone is excited about the activities or games, but of course the purpose of our event today is for you to enjoy and to welcome our first year students. So let's have first our getting to know session. So this time we're going to have our break room session. We will, we will give you five break rooms there and as shown in the presentation, the, fact, the facilitators of each academic program, so here, Next slide. Okay, so with, let's have the AB side. So we have Mr. Mark Rolando Abello with Ms. Alvina Catrina de la Cruz and Abigail Joy Akin, third year representative as the facilitator for AB side. For BPED, we have Mr. René Toquero, Mr. Julius Evan Raimundo, Mr. Frederick William Meva, and Mark Lawrence Carajay, first year representative as their facilitator. For BEE, we have Ms. Eva Morin Milo, Mr. Andre Canaria, Mr. Rochelle de, de Jesus, and Mark Jun Capistrano, auditor of RPC, facilitator of BEE. And also, Ms. Nicolai Aniana Carino, Ms. Madeleine Patricia Cruz, and Edmar Gabriel, Vice Governor of RPC, will facilitate BSE English. And lastly, Ms. Maria Julina Garcia, Mr. Melbert Florencio, Carrie Shane Aragon, and Eric Rico will facilitate students under social studies, mathematics, and Filipino. So you can now go to your assigned breakout rooms. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Doc Virgo. Good afternoon. Afternoon, sir. Afternoon, po. Wait na lang po tayo sa mga ibang site students. Okay, sure. All right, all right. Opo. <laughs> Hmm. How was that? Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. 
how is everyone? Please turn your camera. Good afternoon. While we, okay, Hello. while we wait for your facilitator. This is BPED, right? Mr. Valentin, are you there? I'm seeing now Jim, Julius. How about the rest? Please turn your camera. Mr. Ayan. Mr. Julius is here to, to guide you through. Good afternoon, Mr. Julius Evan. Hi, hi everyone. Good afternoon. Uh, please enjoy. Let me just go to another class. Or yeah, room rather. Participants here. Um, we have committed ourselves to, and I hope that you also would be able to share your piece with the rest of the students that you will be in contact with in the future, because these people or these students that you will be in contact with will be the future of our own generation and their generations too. So, ilang, um, I hope that I will be able to see you on the face-to-face. Sana maging maayos ng lahat. Let's all be safe. And hopefully, everybody uh, will be um, as happy as Jollibee. Joke. <laughs> no, para lang maging masaya tayo. No? Laging natin ibibida ang saya, di ba? So, ayun lang po. And I am so happy to, to be with all of you. And I'm so excited to hear your stories as well. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Kinakanaya. Grabe no yung, yung passion. Talagang may passion. Good afternoon, Mr. B. Welcome po sa B. Good afternoon, Mr. Andre and Ms. Uh, Eva. Nice to Good see afternoon. you. Okay, so good afternoon, everyone. It's my pleasure to be one of the faculty members of the room. Mr. Rene? Yes, sir. How are you here in the main room? Yeah, I'm actually checking, sir, Um, those who um were not assigned yet. I think the BE Ed and the BPED are already okay. Uh, can you hear me loud and clear, Mr. Rene? Mr. Rico? Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. Love. She loves um, her husband very much. Um, and she knows what she wants. She, she's very determined. Uh, she's in control of her life. And... Um, She's ruthless. So turning that character into a positive one is what I would do. So for me, I would describe myself as Lady Macbeth. Okay, um, so that's me. Now um, we have Miss Maddie Cruz for our next one. Mom, I think your microphone is off. While I think while waiting for Miss Maddie, since we have Doc V right here, should do you want to join us? <laughs> so um, for our creative way of um, introducing ourselves, and since we are English majors here, we wanted to um, describe ourselves using a book, a, a character in a book. So do you want to join us by <laughs> doing that? Yeah, thank, thank you, Miss Nicolai. I hope I'm being heard, Mr. Gabriel. All right. May I see a thumbs up if you can hear me loud and clear? Thank you. 
Okay, I was caught off guard. But anyway, let me just share the book I have read during the class of Dr. Engelbert Pasag, our Chief Operating Officer and the former Dean of our RPC. Uh, I think uh, The Little Prince, okay? So I'm The Little Prince. Exploring, for example, life with all the things that we love about this life is something that we look forward to. So I believe I'm in the constant uh, discovery of myself, though I'm already... I'm 30 years old now, and I'm the new dean of the RPC. I think much to be learned and much to, to focus on the important things in life. I think that's me. Thank you, Ms. Nikolai. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, all right, so we have the little friends. Um, next is Ms. Maddie, are you there yet? I'm going to try using my speakerphone. Can you hear it? Is it loud? Yes, ma'am. It's loud. Okay. Okay. I'm so sorry. All right. So for the book that I, the book character that I can associate with, okay, guys, save your judgment. But like, honestly, this is one of my favorite all-time books, uh, The Twilight Saga. And I think um, I really like Bella's character because even though she's like really annoying, she's like over the top in love with her vampire boyfriend, but she has like traits that are really like notable. For, especially for women. So just like what Miss Nikolai said earlier, um, there's love there and then there's also like um, resilience and also um, there's passion. Like if you... Mr. Rico? Yes, sir. How about these uh, students here? Mr. Kenneth, Gregory, Angelica, Francis? Yeah, they were not yet assigned, sir. Okay, so may we ask them to please turn on their respective cameras so that we would know and we could talk to them? Um, guys, can you please turn on your cameras and may I know what course, because you did not put your course or your program on your, as, mm -hmm. as, as advice. Yeah, because Mr. Rico, just observations, the English majors are doing well in their getting to know. Yes. Part. So yes. you are missing something. So you have to know, let us know now so that we could guide you through. Francis, um, Kenneth, Angelica, Ella May. Uh, if you cannot unmute, please type in the chat box. What are your respective courses or specializations? Try it Guys, speak up. Okay, I think they're joining already, some, some of them. Yes, sir. Oh, Mr. Rico, you're, you're missing the, the scene or the, the this activity. Can I English join school. one? Can I join? Can I join them, sir? Oh, yeah, you may. I'll stay here in the okay. moment. Okay, thank you. Can you hear me? Not really. Okay, thank you so much. So next one we have Precious Grace. Oh wait, that's it. A bit lang, but nawala at. Ay, Precious Grace, passion. Hello, wong maganda hapon po. So my name is Precious Grace Passion. Currently taking Bachelor of Secondary Education major in Filipino. So. Nagpili ko po yung Pilipino kasi po, unang-una po sa lahat, 
Um, meron po kasi yung picture na na-inspire ako sa pagtuturo. As in talaga, gusto po kasi makita yung sarili ko na ganun din po ako magturo What, in, in the future po. So yun, yun po yung reason kung bakit po po pinili yung Pilipino na. Okay, thank you so much. So I think we only have last student from Filipino. We have Sanesha. I think yeah, tapos na. So let's have JJ Valdez. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Okay, Ray Ann. Yeah, yun yung hinahanap ko kanina. <laughs> yeah, Miss Ray Ann Ronamo. Ayun, um good day po. Sa inyo. Um, I'm Ray Andronamo. I'm taking Bachelor of Bachelor of Secondary Education major in Filipino. I choose this academic program because um simula pa lang po na na pinili ko po maging teacher eh. Yun na po yung naisip kong major ko, Filipino. Tsaka doon din po ako nag-excel simula pa lang po nung na diyan po nagstand ko po yung ano subject na Filipino. Yan lang po. Okay, thank you so much, Rayan. So let's have the next one, JJ Valdez. Hello, po. Magandang hapon po. Um, I'm JJ M. Valdez. Um, um, but uh, I'm taking Bachelor of Secondary Education major in Filipino. Hello, Mr. Rene. Good afternoon. Miss Maria Kayla Roxan. Hello po. Kindly, kindly open your camera please. Mahina po yung net ko po. Okay lang po. Baka si po naputulan po kami ng net. Nagde-data lang po ako. Is it fine? Fine. Okay lang po ba? Okay po. So in kindly introduce yourself in an artistic way. <laughs> Um, hi, I'm sorry, I'm, uh, I'm late. Uh, my name is Maria Kaila Roxanne Aitoge. You can call me Kaila. I'm an old student of Pan Pacific University, currently taking Bachelor of Arts in Psychology, my second year in this academy. So, I'm 19 years old and I am hoping to be acquainted with you all. Thank you. So, what is your inspiration in life despite the pandemic, Miss Roxanne? My inspiration in life, honestly, is my my family. First, uh, first. Firstly, is my family. Uh, in order to pursue my my academic career, I always think about how the future will hold if I can if I continue despite the struggles of the pandemic. So yeah, I always keep in mind my my situa the situation we are in right now, and in order to to pursue to pursue being a psychology graduate so, and secondly uh, I am actually a k-pop fan so yeah my hobbies are watching my favorite my favorite groups on a daily basis and watching anime reading some books and reading some webtoons yes thank you thank you miss maria Carla Artoge. Next is Miss Carol Palting. Kindly unmute yourself and open your camera. Miss Carol. Miss Carol. Parang mahiyain pa yung mga psychology, Miss Alvina and Mark. 
<laughs> yes. Yeah. Nangyayari ano, 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 open ng cameras eh. Kaya oh. okay. nga. <laughs> uh, Miss Carol actually is a graduating uh, student po. She's an intern now. Isa na lang matatapos na siya. Probably we can move to the next. Okay. Next is Joel Obra. Kaya na magbubuksan yung camera ko kasi maglalag yung ano ko. Okay. okay. Introduce yourself. Yes, good day, good afternoon to everyone. My name is Joel Cariaga Obra and I'm taking up Bachelor of Arts in Psychology 3. Um, I came from Montada, Tarlac and my ambition in life is to become a forensic psychology and my hobbies are reading and exploring new things, like advent adventures, like that. Okay, what is your inspiration in life despite the pandemic, Mr. Obra? Yes. <clears throat> My inspiration in life is to, in this kind of pandemic, is um, myself. I want to, I want to, I want to, I want to graduate and pursue my dreams because I am studying by myself only. No, no parents at all. So that's my inspiration myself to, to, to graduate. That's good. Thank you. Okay. Ms. Terry, are you all done in your team? Yes po, Mr. Vip. Ang hinihintay na lang po, uh, psychology and DPEL po. Yeah, psychology is about to finish as well. Yeah. Yes po. Medyo um, intense lang yung sharing nila ng inspiration <laughs> about studying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sige. Parang ang mga taga-social science, bakit parang di, di kinapag-usapan ang eleksyon, mga ganyan? <laughs> so, nakarehistro na ba kayo? Ganun? Sino Balik tayo sa room. Sa, sa, <laughs> sa, sa B-PED. B-PED. Marami yata sila sa si Oo B-PED. nga, marami gano'n. Or probably, Miss Kyrie, you could somehow merge the different majors here and get to know them as well para, di ba, mas marami, mas masaya. Go ahead. I'm, um, yes. Okay, so, since... Hello po. My name is Jim Lawrence Kutgotow and I'm interested in playing basketball and my inspiration is my family. Okay, Mr. Kutgotow. We would like to acknowledge the presence of our dean, Mr. Virgo Clemente Lopez. Let's give a virtual applause for our dean. So, before we continue with uh, getting to know each other, let's hear it from our dean to give his words and thoughts. <laughs> but, yes. All right. Yes, doon sir. sa kabila kasi, doon sa English, I have to pick a book and then pick a character that would uh, best was this, um, symbolize my personal. Dito ba? Ano ang pagpapakilala? Mr. Mark. Um, I, I friend, sir about challenge one of our fellow students here to you know sir whatever you want to challenge them <laughs> virtually kala ko, ko pipili ng laro halimbawa sepak takraw ganun bakit <laughs> anyway uh, nice to see everyone and uh, uh, mahihiyain din yung iba no si Mr. Polido Valentin hindi pa siya nagte-turn on ng camera Mr. Mones Miss Hazel Ann, Johan, Johan, yan, Gregory, and uh, Mr. Rene is here. All right. So, uh, ito lang yung masasabi ko siguro. You're one of the luckiest batch, batches of BPED kasi the best faculty members are in your program. Okay? So, nakakaya naman kung hindi kayo mag-aaral ng maayos, hindi ba? So, I meant it when I said that you're lucky because Mr. Tokero is here, our Mr. Tokero, sorry with my word, pero ang word ng mga RPC ay legend daw po yung mga ilang taon na sa universidad. Ayun. Di ba, Mr. Karaha, yun ang word nyo? Legend. 
And then, of course, you have young professionals here, Mr. Raimundo and Mr. Villanueva, na they are humble as they are, but as you go on uh, learning with them, you would actually discover that they are simply awesome. Yun lang siguro. Please call Mr. V, and uh, I hope to see you soon in uh, actual classes. Back to you, Mr. Mark. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. V. So let's hear it once again. I should I say, um, <laughs> since we don't have any sister in the may I request sir to share his word and thoughts about this session? Thank you, sir. Yes. Hello. Once again, good afternoon. And is it the group of BPED? I guess so. Yes, sir. Uh, Anyway, what I can say is that uh, welcome to RPC. I know that you are all scholars and uh, no regrets in uh, enrolling for BPED at the uh, Pan Pacific U, especially at uh, RPC. So anyway, uh, you will be knowing me as you go on, okay? Uh, kumbaga is... Uh, Andiyan lang ako sa school and then if in case anything uh, or any concerns, then uh, just ask me, okay? So uh, that's what I can say. Uh, you will be knowing me as we go on. That's it. Thank you. See you soon. Thank you so much, Sir Mene. And I believe I just saw Sir Mene. Thank you so much, everyone. Mr. Gregory. So, sino po yung hindi tapos dito mag ano, to present yourself? I believe we are done with that. Sir Frederick, are we good to go back in our main session room? Um, Mr. Lazo, not yet done. And Mr. Valentin. And Mr. Jim, got it up. Um, yes. Yes, I'm so sorry about that. I didn't. Not this time. So let's let's give it for Anumaka Valentine. Oh. Mr. or Miss? Sir. Hello. Hello, Miss. Hi, sir. Yeah. Sir Anumaka. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, my name is Valentine Adamaka, and I'm basically from Nigeria, West Africa. So I would say that my interest is writing and reading and engaging in sports activities, because I, lo I love sports a lot. And also my inspiration comes from nature. Like, you know, so far I, I haven't seen anybody who have inspired me enough to name anybody. So I would just say nature. So thank you very much. So thank you, Mr. Anumaka. That was a very interesting, interesting information about yourself. Next, Mr. I see Mr. Johan Gabriel Lazo. Sir Johan Gabriel. I think he's from PBS, but we accommodate him, right? Tama po ba, Mr. Rene? Mr. Rene. Tama again, uh, Dr. V. Okay. Um, it's it's written there. It's PBS. Is this the Pan Pacific Business School, right? No, actually, uh, it's their uh, first, uh, the first program that uh, they have enrolled, ah, but okay. they are under BPED. All right. So, Mr. Jo Johan, si Johan ba? Yes, Mr. Johan uh, Lazo. Hello, Mr. Johan. Are you there?
It's okay. That's okay. Andito na ba lahat? Let's check na. Ah, uh, meron pa yung BPED sa breakout session nila. Only BPED na lang pa. Yeah, BPED na lang. So, wala pa si Kuya Edmar, no? Tama ba? Ah, yeah. So, sino pa ba? Sino pa ba yung mga andito ka? King David. Yeah, King David. Oh, okay. Sorry. Ayan, ask to mute. Ay po, good afternoon. Ganda. Maganda. Okay. Okay, so why did you choose your academic program? Can you share also to everyone? So, yun, kasi gustong-gusto ko talaga ng history, world history before. Till now naman, na ano, na-adapt ko na since nung bata pa. Ah, kasi dati galing akong PAMA, which is graduating na dapat ako ngayon. Maritime student. Pero ayoko naman i-graduate yung kursong ayaw ko. Yeah. Diba? Uh, yes. Mahirap naman pong pagsayangan ng oras yun. It's Tama a matter yan. of passion over option. Yes wow. po. <laughs> Para libutin natin, libutin natin ang mundo, King David. PM, sir. <laughs> sir, PM po. <laughs> Yung bogey, Mark. Ako na, ako na naman. <laughs> okay. Sino pa ba dito? Okay. Magtawag naman din tayo ng mga RPC faculty member na mag-share ng short message sa mga RPC students. Agree ba kayo? Yeah. Agree ba kayo? Yeah. Okay. Hanap tayo. Sino? Mauna. Sure. Sir Derek, andito na ba si Sir Derek? Wala pa ata siya, I think. He is actually with BPED. Yeah, BPED siya. And it seems that the, um, he is enjoying the BPED students. How about Edmar? Edmar is still on, in the breakout room. Oh, si Sir Mark Abelo daw. Sabi ni Eric. Sir Mark Abelo, andyan po kayo. Ayan po ba si Sir Mark Abelo? <laughs> May pahawi ng buhay right, si Mark. So, Ayan. Yung, na, okay na, okay na yun ako, Mike. So, everyone, no, so hello. Uh, so, yun pala, no, I want to say congrats pala sa mga students ko. No? So, ayan, sa ba sila, Eric? No? Ang galing naman nakakatawa. Anyway, so, my message, no, to, ah, ano ba yung message ko kanina? Actually, two things, no. I want, I just want to say two things, no. Uh, First is having the commitment, di ba? Yun yung message ko. Commitment and as well as understanding, di ba? So, commitment as a student, no? So, of course, no? Uh, we have this the motivational power, di ba? Pag, uh, the more that you're more committed, no? With your study, the more that you have the motivational power in studying. And ano pa? understanding, no? of course, no? Since we're in pandemic, uh, you need to be understandable, no? Lalo na sa part din nyo as a student. And ayun, uh, as well as our part as an educator. So, we will give you the best education na you need, no? So, yun lang masasabi ko. So, thank you, uh, Student Council. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay. Sino pa na RPC faculty member ang tato? Ah, oh, si Kuya Edward andito na. Ikaw naman, mag-share. <laughs> Tapos na kami. Ikaw naman. Yes, yeah, sige na. <laughs> Un- unmute daw si Edmar. Ayan, as on mute na. Nag-share na kami kanina, bakit mo raw uh, kinuha yung kurso mo? Um, to be honest, mm? I don't have <laughs> any choice. Beauty queen? Because my dream course talaga was political science. But I since was. my parents were against, kunin ko daw yung baka daw maging baliw ako. So yun lang yung available kasi sa ano P. And ngayong graduating na ako na enjoy ko na mm-hmm. sa awa ng Jones. Salamat sa Jones. Wow naman. <laughs> okay, so hinihintay na lang talaga yung BP. BP with sir sila. Derek. Freder- uh, f- sir Derek and Mark Lawrence and dun sila. Kay reiter din natin si ano, si Ma'am yung si Ma'am, ano nang name niya? Milo. Si Ma'am Eva. Ang Ma'am nanay. Milo. Si Ma'am Eva. Yes. Ang nanay ng Pio. <laughs> andyan po ba si Ma'am Milo? Yes, andyan siya. Hi, Ma'am. <laughs> Ma'am. Ma'am. 
Yeah, it is spelling the jack, jumping jack. Yeah. Good afternoon, everyone. Hi, Good afternoon, pa. Good afternoon, ma. Yeah, I was the the GHC blue house captain before. That's why Edmar knows me. Nanay nga sabi niya, I was the blue house captain. Uh, <laughs> and uh, Edmar is a blue team, kaya kilala niya ako. Yes, but ma. I was at the registrar's office before uh, during that time na naging house captain ako. So for everyone, let us work as a team, as a family, as uh, of course brothers and sisters, so that we will have that common goal for our PC. Diba? And some of you here are my students last term, last term ba? second and third trimester. So I hope you will um, cooperate and engage very well, especially for the uh, student council officers. Thank you so much and welcome everyone. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, po. Uh, Casey, pa? Uh, it took so long. Yeah. I think nag overtime na sila. <laughs> Na-enjoy nila. <laughs> Na-enjoy nila. Anong course? Anong major? Biped. Siyempre, na doon si Sir Frederick. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes. Pap- Di ba sabi niya sa meeting kanina, hindi sila magpapatalo daw sa interview. Oh, Sunduin ko na Ayan. sila. <laughs> sinun, sinundo na ni sir na id- I see Mr. Derek are you done here? yes sir ayun na lang we're, we're near ayun na lang inihintay ng taong bayan <laughs> alright sir so we're yes okay. so we're done na po okay 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 so there okay so Okay na tayo dyan. So, tapos na. Everyone showed their um, things the na, na proud kayo doon and lahat ay nag-explain. Na, ay, ang ilan ay nag-explain. Okay? Alright? So, I think we can leave, uh, please click the leave button. Uh, specifically, the leave breakout room. Okay? Go be ped and join all the activities. Okay? Top all the... To follow every activity that will be assigned to us. Yes. Mga naan. Ayan. Pabalik na sila. Hi. Oh yes. Pabalik na sila. Sana all bumabalik. Hmm? Ay. <laughs> Eric, oh my God, no. Mark. Mark. What's that? Eric, no. <laughs> Eric. Balik ka na. Hindi na bumalik ako. Pasalo. <laughs> <laughs> Pasalo talaga. No. <laughs> Sige na may good tune dito. Nakabalik, Nakabalik na pa lahat? Oo. Okay na? Okay, so let's start our program na ba? Yeah. Okay. Sure. All right, welcome back everyone. So I hope you enjoyed your meet and greet session with your classmates and facilitators. Well, regardless of the modality in which we learn, whether online or on campus, building connections and studying with classmates is an impactful factor. People can have a tremendous influence on you and vice versa. We all have so much we can learn from each other also. So to continue our program, may I call Eric Wico, treasurer of RPC, and Mark Jun Capistrano, auditor RPC, to host our first game. Ayan, so... Asa <laughs> Mark Jun. Hello. <laughs> Ayan, so ang unang game natin is yung tinatawag natin na... Uh, parang sa speed game lang. Kahoot. Ayan. So, ang gagawin nila is may pa- para sila magpapasukan na isang portal and then magbibigay kami ng passcode and pag enter ng passcode, mapupunta sila sa uh, dun- direkta sa game. And then after nun, pwede silang mag-change ng team nila and then yung mananalo na top 3 magkakaroon ng so, so, unang premyo is yung certificate and then pangalawang premyo sabi ni Gov at saka ni Vice Gov magbibigay daw sila ng pangkabuhayan showcase. What? 
<laughs> Di ba, Gov? Ang kabuhayan showcase. Wow. Yan. Totoo ba yan? Totoo sure. Okay. Okay, so yan, hindi namang ano. Gcash niya lang. Send you cash. Ayan. So, una, gagawin nila is go to kahoot.id. Ayan. So, Skype pa din para sulo para type ano, sa chat box. Okay, wait. Kahoot.id. Ayan. So, itype mo yung unang step. Punta sa Google ko. So, punta kayo sa Google or, yeah, kahit anong website dyan. Then, type kahoot.it and then uh, paging Miss Abigail po pala. What's the pin? <laughs> Can you type na lang po sa chat or share screen mo na lang? Mag-stop share na lang ako. Yes. Josh, tignan mo yung ano ko. Chat ko sa'yo. Ayan, sa mga estudyante po na gusto sumali sa first activity po natin is papasok lang po kayo or itatype nyo lang po yung kahoot.it sa uh, Chrome nyo po sa internet browser. Ayan, so. Hindi ako makashare screen. Uh, pwede po paki-allow po si Abigail to share to share her screen po. Um, Okay, so everyone, please go to kahoot.it and then enter this game pin. Then also put your nickname. Hintay namin kayo dito. So yung pin po natin is 826 4951. Again, ang pin po natin, 826-4951. Miss Terry, sumali si Sir Ivan. Yan. So, may mga nakikita na tayo sa screen. Si Kyla, Jed, Rene, Tito. Baka mayroon pa si Tita. Ayan, uh, Sam, Clifford, Valerie, Aika, Eds. Ayan, dami na pumapasok, Kyrie. Okay, so let's wait pa yung iba dahil para mas mas marami, mas masaya. True. And yung mananalo, may surprise talaga. Ayan, send you na lang yung Gcash nyo and then si Gov at saka si Vice Gov ang magbibigay ng Gcash. Sponsored yan, ha? <laughs> Sponsored. Uh -huh. Okay, again, yung pin po natin, 826-4951. You have free scramble on the go once you win. <laughs> Pwede. <laughs> yeah, with bubble waffle. <laughs> bubble waffle. Tito Sai, Clifford, Valerie, Joel Obra, Leah, Reg, C, M, M, Ayan, Dominic, Luisa, K, N, Hayes, J, R, That's Joe, Suma sumali ba kayo, Kairi? No. Ay? Si Kuya Edmar. Kuya Edmar. Dear Ren, give chance to others. <laughs> Ang hinihin. <laughs> well, actually, dito sa quiz natin, more on ano lang siya. Hukulaan nila kung sino sa tingin nila yung ganito, yung ganyan. Yeah. Sila nang bahalang manghula. Pero... Most of the question naman, madali lang siya. For sure, baka possible pa na may maka-perfect eh. Pag na-perfect daw, may additional ulit na, na premyo. We have 39 participants. 40. So half of, almost half. So, pwede pa pong sumali, kahoot.it, and then ang game pin po natin, 826-4951. 
Eds, MJ, MCG, and okay, We have 40 participants na sa game. Ayan, okay. so last week. Let's start na daw. Okay, let's, let's start. What does RP SEA stands for? So, in a red, Rome Padilla School of Education and Arts. In a yellow, R Rome Padilla School of Education and Arts. For the blue, Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts. And then for the green is Romeo Padillion School of Education and Arts. Okay, so 13 na nakakuha. The correct answer is Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts. May mamali pa rin? <laughs> Ayan. So Ayla. now, <laughs> Sai Kaila, Sisi, and that's Joe. Okay, yes, may time limit po ito I para did. hindi po tayo maka-Google. Mahirap sure. na. <laughs> Walang Google dito. <laughs> Siyempre, kailangan lagi may oras. Yes. Next. Who is the Dean of RPCA and also the Editor-in-Chief of Maestra Publication? Okay, for the red, Dr. Virgo Clemente Lopez. For blue, Mr. Renette Siquero. For yellow, Mr. Frederick Villanueva. And for the green, Mr. Mark Roland Abelio. Ayan. Ewan ko nilang pag may hindi pa nakakuha. Okay. Alam, may hindi pa nakakuhang pito. Sino kaya yon? <laughs> My God. Nakausapin daw sila mamaya. <laughs> Mga nangamayo. Magre-report daw sila kay Dean. Ayan. Kaya report natin kay Dean, hindi nila kilala si Dean. Okay, next tayo. Next. Yes. Ayan, pagpasensya nyo, medyo maingay yung background. Dito. Ulit daw. <laughs> Jim Lawrence, ulit. RPCA Student Council Advisors. O, sino sila? Unang mukha. Magandang maganda. Pangalawa, maganda din. Ay, lahat. Tas guapo, magaganda at guapo. Pili na. Ayan, so una si Sir Fred, pangalawa si Sir Rene, and then pangatlo and pangapat. Ayan. Okay, so may nakakuhang some 10, 7, and then ang tamang sagot is si Sir Rene and then si Sir Frederick. Ayan, so may anim na nagkamali. Sino kaya yun? Okay, sa leading board, si C. Pang yes. Mga pangalawa sa kanya si Julina and then si Rose. Wow. Sino si C? Sino si C? <laughs> Hala. Sino daw si C? May premyo ka raw kay Dean o C. Sino ka C? Oo. Oh, oh, <laughs> kapag, kapag siya pa rin. <laughs> Danny boy. <laughs> okay, next. Ayan, who do you think is the Vice President of University Student Supreme Council of RPCA? Ayan, sino kaya? Pag nagkamali pa kayo, ewan ko na lang. Maganda daw siya, clue, maganda. He was clue. Ay, wait lang. Tama. Irasyon na guys, may wait to. University. Oh my God. Nalilito ka na, sis. <laughs> oh, sorry. Ako oh, pala university. Yeah, tama si Kuya Renny Boy, Rico. Congrats kaya rin eh. Mag <laughs> Maganda raw. <laughs> Ayan, tuloy. Namisilid na mo sila doon. Maganda raw. Hindi. <laughs> sorry, Kuya. Medyo na tama. Okay, next. Next, okay. Ayan, she is the deputy head of School of, Be uh, of Basic Education, or SBE, and also one of the psychology instructors in RPCA. Okay, and yung picture niya, sino siya? 
Ayan. Okay, may 22 nang magsasagot. 28, 29. Mukhang kilalang kilala nila. True. Oh, so, kilala nga ng karamihan. Kilala ng karamihan. Siguro yung mga hindi nakakuha first year. Yes. <laughs> okay, ang answer ay si Ma'am Madeline Patricia Cruz. Okay, next. Oh my God, sisi pa rin ang leading. Nangunguna, palabarn. Sir Dean, mukhang mapapahamak at may premyo. Papapa house and mat si si. Hindi hmm. lang. Basta siya yung number one pa rin. <laughs> He is the head coach of varsity team and also one of the RCC instructor in education. Ayan, sino siya? Sir Andre Canaria, Sir Julius Evan Raimundo. Varsity Sir... players know this. Jesus, or Sir Frederick Villanueva. Ayan, maganda ito ang version no, sa mga athlete. <laughs> Ayan. Karamihan na naman nakakuha. Ayan, alam na alam nila. Siguro naman tama na ako. Oh. Ano bang sagot mo, Jim Lorenze? Jim Lorenz, you got it correct. Okay, next. Ah, si Jim ata, varsity player ba natin? Yes. Oh, yeah. So, uh, for sure, alam na alam niya. Okay, next. Ay, wala na si C. Si, si Roda na ang na, na, nanguna. Wala mo na. Wala ang pabuhayang showcase at house. And wala lock. na ang pabuhayang showcase ni C. Napunta na kay Roda. Sino si Roda? <laughs> <laughs> Grabe naman. <laughs> Sino kasi si Rod? Then, next na. Okay. True or false? Mr. Oh, yeah. Julius Cabanero Mundo is a PE instructor and former UAAP player. Uh, UAAP volleyball player. Again, Mr. Julius Cabanero Mundo is a PE instructor and a former UAAP volleyball player. Oh my God, you're a volleyball player. True or false? Feeling ko napapanood ko siya. Pogi oh, wow. na. <laughs> Mr. Wito. Ayan, true. Anong school po si Sir Raymundo? Interviewin natin siya. Go, tawagin Mr. Wito. Mr. Wito? Tawagin mo si Sir Julius. Po, school po kayo. Take it away, Sir Julius. There. Ayan, si Sir Julius. Hi, everyone. So, siguro yung sagot. <laughs> ah, hi, sir. <laughs> hi, sir. Hello, isin po kayo, sir. Ang <laughs> lande. <laughs> so, um, I graduated from uh, from the University of the Philippines. Uh, yeah, Diliman. Well, I'm a Galiner, scholar, maroon. <laughs> um, uh, yes, uh, because... I was a varsity, so I got a scholarship back then. Uh, uh, so, magandang po kayo pumalo, sir. <laughs> pwede, pwede. pwede. <laughs> Paluin mo nga, Mr. Julius. Unahin mo siya. Sige, pag nakita kita sa school, ha, papaluin kita agad. Ayan, sir. Wag po. Magandang po ko mag-block. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ayan. So, turo po yung sagot. So, ilan na nakakuha? 30. 30 ang nakakuha. Ay, nauna ulit si C. Bumalik siya. Palabarn talaga. Habol. Ayan. So, si Sairi ata yun, Sairi. Hindi <laughs> ako sumali, ha? <laughs> yes. Oo nga, feeling ko siya yun. <laughs> Jimmy Boy, Habol. Ayan. The pioneer faculty of RPCA who served for more than 20 years Who is she? Ayan. Madam na madam si madam. Ayan. Sino siya? Miss Eva, may kwento ko mamaya. Hindi pa yun ang word na ginamit kanina. Diba, Hala, sir! <laughs> Miss Eva, ito kwento ko sa'yo. <laughs> okay. Ang sagot ay, Ma'am Eva Maureen Milo. So, siya ang pioneer faculty of RPC. <laughs> Ako nagsabi ng pioneer, natin. sir, ha? Pioneer. Sino, sino bang nagsabi nun? 
<laughs> Let's Ms. welcome Eva. Ma'am Eva. Ang, ang word nila ay... <laughs> sir, <laughs> pioneer yung sinabi ko, sir, di ba? <laughs> Ms. Eva, asan ka? Yes, I'm here, sir. Ayan, sabi natin. Spotlight natin si Ms. Eva. Ayan. Grabe. Miss Eva, alam mo ba kung anong salita yung ginamit nila kanina para ipaliwanag kung ano po yung pioneer? Ano po yun, sir? <laughs> oh, Miss uh, Kyrie, sabihin mo yung salita. <laughs> Wala kong alam dyan, pioneer. Ang so, wala rin po kung alam. Hindi okay, po ako yung gumawa. Si Miss Eva, sa tagal po ninyo po sa university, Miss Eva, ano po yung mga pagbabago sa ating mga studyante in the past years? Uh, actually po, I've been to teaching kasi 1998 to 2004 and then naging non-teaching staff na po ako from that uh, 2004 up to 2020. 20, 20. <laughs> Ayan no? Legend na legend si Ma'am Eva. And then bumab- <laughs> bumabalik po ako sa teaching. Um, ang pag... Siguro mas ano na po kasi sila, mas high-tech po sila ngayon through internet na po kasi. Unlike before, makikita mo lahat ng sudyante mostly na sa library, nag-aagawan ng libro. So ngayon, nag-aagawan ng computer kung saan sila po pwesto or nag-aagawan ng pwesto kung saan may internet. Yun po yung nakikita ko. <laughs> oh, di ba, Ms. Eva? Dalian Pioneer! Ay, hello! <laughs> Mr. Rene Boy, ha? You're a graduate of Hotel and Restaurant Management, tama ba? Yes po. Sige, salamat Ms. Eva. Let's Thank give Ms. Eva a heart icon, di ba? Sadya naman, loyalty at its best and commitment yes. to the university. Thank you, Ms. Eva. Ms. Kyrie, back to you. Okay, thank you po, Ms. Eva. So let's proceed to the next question. Question number nine. Okay, so question number nine. Miss Maria Julina Garcia is a creator and a psycho- psychology instructor. Is it true or false? Mm, 30 get correct. Ah, 15, only 15. Let's call on Miss Julina. The answer is false. Pa unmute me, Miss Miss Julina is asking for her to be unmuted. Hi, Mom. Hi. Good afternoon, everyone. <coughs> ano po yung totoo, Miss Julina? Ang dami ko nalilang. <laughs> Go, Miss Kati. Kayo po ay? Um, I am a social studies major on uh, social studies, pero hindi po ako curator. <laughs> Malapit pala, charot. <laughs> hindi po. <laughs> Writer and as well as siyempre po. Uh, ayan, a student leader. Oh, di ba? Parang kaedad nyo lang si Miss Jolina. Bigyan natin siya ng... Uh, uh, 19 lang po ako. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Miss Jolina. Thank you po, Miss Jolina. Okay. So, ang nakakuha ay 15. Karamihan ay hindi nila nakuha yun. Number one pa rin natin ay si C. Ayan. Pakitalo po si C para walang premyo. Bilisan nyo, Jimmy Boy. Kalingan Jimmy mo. Boy, Blank, Pony, Roda. Okay, who do you think is the vice governor of RPC Student Council? Ay, ito. Maganda to. Pintas. Literal na maganda. Akala ko nung una siya yung muse natin. Ann Curtis <laughs> ang dating. Ann Curtis. Chinita version ni Ann Curtis. Ayan. Oh, ang ganda. Edmar Gabriel, ikaw naman pala eh. Pito lang ang hindi nakasagot. Pausapin ko po yung pito. 
Mamaya. <laughs> well, may nagsabi para ka daw Koreana, oh. may nag-comment. Jim Lawrence, good ka tao. Parang Koreana. Ano masasabi mo doon, Edmar Gabriel? Thank you. Hinihin. Hinihin naman. Yun lang. Okay. Ano nga sa'yo? Okay. So, let's have the next question. Si talaga, si... Si si pa rin, number one. Okay. Who among faculty is the ambassador of Pangasinan and currently crowned as Mr. Pangasinan 2021? Uy, baka kilala mo ito, Kuya Renny Boy. Sino yan, Kuya Renny? Ah, yan? Pogi. Oh my God. Pogi. Familiar. I actually have a compilation of his pictures. Ayun, si Mr. Frederick Milman. <laughs> Sir Frederick, baka may gusto po kayong sabihin. And hello. <laughs> <laughs> Natense tuloy siya. <laughs> Ayan po, yes po. Uh, ako po ang currently crowned Mr. Pangasinan 2021. And yes, welcome to RPC. Ilang sir, wala bang may pa I believe diyan? Ganun. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, sige. I think I can share you uh, my principle in life which is the 3C, choices, chances, changes. You must make a choice to take a chance or your life will never change. We cannot change the world in one day, but one day we can change the world. And wow. I. Powerful. Sorry, Kuya Rico. And Wala I. Na, talo ka dyan, mm. Kuya Rico. And I. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Isang rampa dyan, sir. <laughs> Pasarela walk. <laughs> Nanguhuna pa rin si letter C. Mga pangalawa si Jimmy Boy. Okay, so he is the happy pill of the RPC because of his enthusiastic and charismatic personality. Who is he? Ay, isa ako dito sa saksi. Naniniwala ako dito talaga. Siya yung happy pill ng aming classroom. Sana Man, all, may happy pill. Oo, siya yung, Sana all. Sana all. yung nasayahin. Uy, bakit ganun yung spelling ng name ni Kuya ano, Rico? Ginawa kong Sir Rene. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so ang sagot ay Mr. Mark Abello. <laughs> okay, so marami rin naman nakakuha. So next na tayo. Number 13. Si pa rin talaga. O si nga pa eh. Si Tina. Si tsaka si Jimmy, Jimmy Boy. Si Sairi. Tsaka Jimmy. Hindi ko si ano. Kapistrano to. Hindi ako kasali. <laughs> Okay, who do you think is the reigning Miss from Pacific University and the secretary of RPC Student Council? Ay, nagpinda sa ata. <laughs> no, yan. Sino kaya yun? Ganda. 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 Ganda naman. My God, Miss Edward Gabriel. Sino ko? No, ko kailangan nyo. <laughs> Yung makakuha ng tamang sagot, my free na scramble on the go, just to visit <laughs> Billy Aziz. Oh, Sponsor. 35. Okay, so... Ang nakatama ay 35. So, sino yung dalawa? Ang nagsagot ng Abigail. Hindi, laban na ni Abigail. Umasa pa naman siya. Abigail. Aragon. Yes po. Kakausapin natin si Juan. Si Johan daw. May gustong sabihin. Ay! Patlight natin si Johan. Interviewin. May tanong daw sa sayo. Na Sige, Sige jo- Johan. Go, Johan. It's your time. Ano question? Panapin natin siya. Ayan. Johan Gabriel Lazo. Uh-oh. Ay! <laughs> Maayaw niya. Nahiya na siya. Sige. Mamaya na daw. Okay. Ako nalang magsasabi, Kyrie. Bubulong ko sa iyo later. Ganon. <laughs> okay, Buga, sige. Eh. <laughs> Ang pogi, no? Okay, so punta na tayo sa 14 question. <laughs> Bidding pa rin, si C. Next. Ayan. 
True or false? Okay, Miss Abigail Joy Akan is the third year representative of RPC and a BSE Social Studies student. Is it true or false? Sa mga wala pong kabebe time dyan, pwede po si Abigail. Si Abigail, o kanina nilalapit sa screen yung mukha. Ganyan na ganyan na siya kanino. Ay, bakit ganon? Kung di lang nakakuha. <laughs> Ate Abigail, ano masasabi yes. mo? Hindi po ako BSE Social Studies, kundi Psychology Student po. Okay. Taray. Taray naman. Okay, sige. Punta na tayo sa last question. Hmm, si pa rin. Muna. Alabarn talaga si C. He is the auditor of RPC Student Council and he is also part of Pampacific University Coral. Uy, kilala ko to. Coral. Pagsampalin natin siya. Oo nga, Coral eh. Oh my God. Dapat may special sample, number yan. Sample. Ang ganda naman ng finale na ano, question. Siguro nga ikaw yung C. Kapistrano. Oh. Ayan. Sino yung kwan yung 11 ata? Sino yung 11 dyan? Eric Wiko. Kuya Renny po, kasali ka dito. Ano din? Ang tangin na. Sample 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 na. Sir, pause tayo ngayon. Ang pogi. Sige Walang na. Walang pause. Lang. Mark dyan. Walang pause, pause dito. Sige na para sa akin. Sinasabi kong... Oh. Uh, <laughs> Umuulan dito, sir. Pati rin dito. <laughs> Baka lumakas. <laughs> Ayan na. Sige na, go. Sample na. Tomorrow is here. Wow. <laughs> Wow, loyalty. Oh, oh, <laughs> 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 Tapos na yun? May loyalty award ka na. Yung umpisa pa lang, alam ko na, dream. <laughs> dream. <laughs> And Pacific University him. <laughs> okay, thank you so much, Mark. So, now we announce natin ang ating top three winners. Third place, Jimmy Boy. Oy. Ako yan, Renny Boy yan. <laughs> Second, Master. <laughs> And our first place is si C. Sino si C? Ako. Pa- okay. You want to know. Pakitype Sino naman si C. Pakitype Sino naman si sa chat box kung sino tong mga C master at Jimmy, Jimmy Boy. Boy. Itatype ko na ba yung name ko? Renny Boy dapat yan eh. <laughs> Jimmy Boy na bago. Sino yung C? Sino to? Nag-message sa akin. Ah, okay. Okay. <laughs> Clemente ano Lopez. Faculty. Faculty si Miss C. Alright. So dahil ah. doon, nagbibigay sana ako ng papremyo. Meron sana ng cash prize via GCash. Ah, Pero si Sir. Faculty. Si Sir Mark. Faculty you must... din yung second place. Jimmy Boy is Jim Lawrence. Good good tao. From okay. Ipet. Nice uh, naman. Sinabing may cash prize para may mga nagsabing sila na yung si C. Sana hostesya. <laughs> si Master. <laughs> Si Master pala si... Pa-validate na lang. Tapos kung sino man siya, meron siyang Gcash. Ayun. Pa-validate. Uy, ako, oh. Pero ako, po, ako po pala yung... Ba't si... kami, sir? Exempt ng mga RPC Student Council. Ano ba yan? Ay. Ay. Oh, sige na. Okay. So, okay. Screenshot daw natin ang results. So, Miss Beverly, ko na bahala doon. Okay, so moving on to the highlight of this event. Last time we sent the registration form to everyone and also we included there to put your picture in choosing the top five faces of the day, female and male category. So of course, the committee uh, chose the top 10 faces of the day. Okay, so nasaan yung ano, criteria natin? Kuya Edmar. Dinig-dinig yung ulan. Oh. oh, there. Okay, so this is our criteria in choosing the faces of the day. Decency, 50%. Appeal, 50%. And a total of 100%. So, actually, nakapili na po ang ating mga RPC student council. Kung sino po yung mananalo dito. So, Bago namin i-announce, here's a short video of those who uploaded their picture. Hmm. 
Diyan, si Sir ang nanalo. <laughs> Wait lang po. Technical issues. Actually, uh, uh, matinding discussion yan. Umabot sila ng almost midnight for for this top 10. Hindi okay. Do you want me to share, Edmar? Or ikaw na lang sila? Okay, so I'll just share my screen. So please wait. Yeah.
Okay, so napanood natin ang mga RPC students yung mga nagpasa ng kanilang pictures. So bago natin i-present yung top 10, you can comment yung kung sino yung bet nyo. So are we ready? Okay, Kuya Edmar, to play. to thank everyone for participating in our event today. All of you will be able to receive a certificate of appreciation for participating in our event today. Also, our three winners from our Quiz B game will receive a certificate of recognition. So we're, we have the third place, second place, and first place. For our top 10 faces of the day, female and male categories will also receive their certificate of recognition. Lastly, of course, our PC Student Council will also receive a certificate of appreciation for their exemplary contribution as the organizer and facilitator during the conduct of the virtual acquaintance, a glimpse of the new faces. All of you will be able to receive your certificate after the event. Okay, so of course, there you have it. Let's now lend our ears to Dr. Virgo Lopez, Dean of the Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts for his inspirational message. Let's all give him a virtual clap. All right, good afternoon, everyone. If you can hear me loud and clear, may I see a party popper icon from everyone? I'm sorry, I don't have my earphones. I just need to have one again next time. Anyway. Let me share it from my screen. Okay, uh, my speech would not last long. Uh, let me um, have the words fresh start, all right? Or start fresh for somehow. So I would like first to thank or to greet first our faculty members, our collaborators, and our active and committed members or officers of the Student Council. Magandang hapon sa lahat. And to our students who are here, na kahit na uh, the internet connection is unstable. You are still here. Kahit na nakasarap ang yung mga um, camera, we can feel you virtually. All right. So please use the chat box and answer this question. Are you ready, Pan Pacifics, for the resumption of classes on Monday? Yes or no? All right. Let's see. Sinong maunang sasagot? Oh, you know. Yes, daw. Okay. That's a good thing. I can feel and I can see that you are optimistic and you miss really learning despite the online, you know, you know, the challenges of online education. So that's good. Now, my next question is this. How was your meaningful and restful break? Ano ang inyong mga ginawa? Please, um, type one activity, for example, played ML, for example, or, you know, you ate the whole time, or let's say, no, what did you do? Let's have a quick survey. Nung walang pasok, when the city of Ordaneta um, had the cancellation of classes and told you it will be on October 4 already, what did you do? Oh, get vaccinated. Yeah. Watch Squid Game. Is that? Yeah, Squid Game. Sana all my Netflix in ba? All right. So that's good. Um, at least you have had your meaningful activities. And how many of you 
check your Google Classroom because, you know, Mr. Julius Evan Raimundo had several announcements already. I have also checked Mr. Andre Canaria. Um, he extended the submission of, you know, your, your homework. So the question is, come Monday, would you be able already to submit your requirements? Would you already be able to comply yung natulog na papel or yung pinapagawang outline? I said thumbs up from everyone. If you say yes, you're ready to submit those requirements. Okay. Now, um, let's play the bingo on the go. You please have a screenshot of this and I would be happy or the student council would be happy to compile all your answers. Who among you could probably win if the numbers would be changed to words or activities as we begin the school year? For example, under B, are you a scholar? Definitely, most of you would cross this out, right? May I see a heart sign from those students here who are already confirmed scholars of the Romeo Padilla School of Education and Arts? Yeah, you deserve it. And in return, of course, you have the duty to actually study well, all right? So that's the listing that you can do. You were granted scholarship. So the listing that you can do is to study well. All right, please say the last word. Study what? Sabay sabay, please unmute. Study well. Study well. Yeah, thank you so much, Mr. Rico. You're really the governor and you're really the vice president. I'm sorry, the president. Oh no, the vice president, yes. And then how many of you have already met your classmates virtually? Of course, all of you had, right? on the first week of the supposed start of classes last time. And then take a look at the other words here. For example, study smart. How many of you are strategic enough to really plot, for example, the activities? Who among you have already written their schedule? And how many of you, you know, how many times did you email the dean or, for example, the kins or your uninvited or you're not yet invited in your Google Classroom. So these are all the activities that you are supposed to do. And please cross them out and let's see if you're going to win. If in case, that's a bingo. All right. So may I see, um, I mean, a word bingo on the chat box if you can actually accomplish something from here, like from this portion, ready to face the challenges, join student clubs, make ethical and safe choices, Explore a new and meaningful journey. Meron po bang bibingo in case? Mr. Gabriel Edmar, please unmute. Uh, I'll be reading some words here, then tell me if it is bingo or not, all right? Materials for online class ready. Yes, sir. Bingo. Okay. I said bingo, right? I said bingo, sir. All right, good. Okay, follow instruction. How about this? To make PU proud, Pan Pacific University proud. Bingo. Set personal and academic goals. Bingo. 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 And finally, catalyst of change and respect. Bingo, sir. Oh, wow. All right. Let's have the president or the, the governor, Mr. Rico. I am a scholar. Bingo. <laughs> Mr. Rico, you should unmute. Come on. You cannot. There. Still hanging. <laughs> no, you are. You, you should already accept. You should already, you know, anticipate. How about this? Bingo. Self-care over stress. Bingo. Engage in activities for self-growth. Bingo. And finally, manage time wiser. Bingo. All right. So we're just, you know, still to confirm the first one. But I think you are. <laughs> all right. So there you go. Please have a screenshot and do this on your own. Uh, the purpose of this is for you to have actually a perspective or let's say, um, what's this, the big picture of your preparation of the upcoming, upcoming uh, classes, all right? So let's move on. So this game, as per the university or the Philippine Normal University, because I have taken this from their website or Facebook account, these are from the five social and emotional learning competencies that you students need to have. We have the following, self-awareness. Do you really know yourself? Please type in the chat box, I am who I am, if you know yourself. You know that this is how you study. You know that this is the things that make you happy. These are the things that make you angry, for example, and so on. If you know yourself, please type in the chat box, I am who I am. Oh, there you go. So you have a self-awareness, okay? Next. 
enough for you to know yourself. Of course, you have to manage yourself, meaning if you are angry, for example, if you have this kind of irritation and so on and so forth, if you have this kind of anxiety, do you do things to at least control yourself? Or at least if you are problematic, what are the things that you do? What are the relaxation techniques? Our AB psychology students here know this well, all right? So how many of you are like that? Third is social awareness. Are you aware of the things happening around you? For example, your, your uh, relationship with your friends or with your family, which is linked to the next one, relationship skills. How good are you in interpersonal skills? Of course, we respect those people who have interpersonal skills, but of course, you have also to develop interpersonal, more likely even if it is virtual, there are activities by your faculty members that would require you to work or to collaborate. So if you don't, for example, like wala pa kayong group chat, or for example, you have to come up with group chat and then wala ka pa doon. So should you just remain uh, to be uh, outside of that group or should you initiate to reach out? So this is a skill for you to develop. And finally, responsible decision making. Should you tell your faculty that this is your concern? Or should you just remain quiet? For example, you're not that comfortable in the discussion or let's say you're not learning anything. Or for example, you did not understand a concept. Would you just say, yes, I understood, even if it's not? So that's a decision for you to make. So it's okay to be assertive. It's okay to be expressive. But definitely, you should say it um, in a good way. Or, uh, of course, trying to follow lines of communication. So these are the five things that I would like you to work on as students for this coming school year and for the school years to come. Now, I have interviewed most of the freshmen. Anyway, let's give them a virtual clap, please, for making it here you know, for the good start, right? And most of them are well-rounded. They are talented. They are intellectual. They're eager to learn and to teach and they're innovative and transformational. Do you know that one of you, uh, one of the freshmen actually is a writer. One of them is actually a singer. One of them is actually an editor-in-chief before, before. So these are the characteristics or the manpower, if I may say, that RPC has. So the, our student council should really look into this and should really coordinate with them for us to be able to maximize their talents, okay? But more than this, these are the tips in times of crisis. Let me turn crisis in the sense that what if, for example, you're already overwhelmed by the bulk of paperwork or by your academic requirements? What should you do? May I share these five things or four things rather? Number one, prioritization matters, okay? Marami pong problema, pero hindi ibig sabihin, we should solve the problems at the same time. Live every day, live one at a time, fix one problem at a time, okay? And then you prioritize, which among here or among all the activities should you do first, all right? That's a skill actually, not only studying, but when once you become professionals. What else? Mind over matter. You know this, um, the mind is so powerful that once you convince that this is what you should be you capable of doing, then actually you are, all right? Have an optimistic and growth mindset. Let me specify the last two words, growth mindset. Most of us have fixed mindset, meaning, oh, okay na yan, you know, this kind of things, run of the mill. We are just okay with, oh, say, late na po kasi ako, sige, okay na yan, you know? But growth mindset would tell us the challenges that would make us somehow better or for us to, to achieve our potentials. And finally, the three L's. Laugh, learn, and live, all right? And so keep an eye, do the right thing, contribute and share your best self altruistically. You don't know, you do not need to say that, wala naman ako makukuha dyan, wala naman pa certificate yung webinar, why would I attend, you know? These are the common notions and characteristics of students. So we must be different, all right? So without certificate, you should volunteer, you know, you should initiate. Make a difference and live life to the full. These are big words, but I hope with, um, with your intention of learning and finishing your course, eventually these all things would lead to this. And so important reminders, the first wave would begin or had started on September 9 to 14, but it would resume on October 4. This is um, the announcement from Ms. Maggie from the Office of the University President. So the first wave would run from October 4 to November 10. The second wave would start November 11 to December 28. I'm sure na may nagtataasa na naman ng kilay. What? Even Christmas? My class, eh, for example? So wait for official announcements, but this is the schedule given. All right? Now, attend online classes on Monday, 
coordinate and collaborate with classmates and faculty through, please, your Pan-Pacific email and Google chat. The faculty members, including us, the administrators, were reminded constantly not to entertain any concerns via Facebook. So please, for you to be entertained, use your emails, all right? If you forgot your email, you know what to do. Please type in the chat box, what office should you consult if you forgot your email and the password? Come on. Do you know that's Teams. Teams. Very good. That's good. All right. And then please check your Google Classroom. Let me emphasize that. In the past, if you notice, for the freshmen here, if you notice, wala pa yung mga information last time. Okay? But right now, do not be overwhelmed. For example, oh my God, I have nine Google Classrooms. So does it mean that I have to attend all these classes at the same time? No. So please check your Google Classroom. There are details before or right? after the title of your course for example first wave it means to say that's october 4th to november 10 all right and then okay for a while let me stop my video miss kairi am i still being heard kairi yes for mr okay v. thank you and then this is the the schedule friday that's eight o'clock to 12 30 and you have here your faculty why is it important for you to know your faculty because knowing their last name, if you have concern, you're just going to type via Google or Gmail rather, then their full name will come up, including their email address. So please, from now on, make it a habit to check the details of your Google Classroom. If this is clear, may I see a heart sign from everyone, especially the freshmen. So this would really save you from any questions because everything is already here. The wave that would facilitate this class, the, the date and the time and the faculty for the details of your email, just in case you have concerns, all right? Now, let me move on to the next. Okay, here we go. So important reminder still support and be part of the RPC Student Council through, of course, being collaborators. What else? Um, express yourself through proper lines of communication and but please, if you're going to email the education dean or any of your faculty, please be respectful as well. Like say, dear ma'am, dear sir, or dear mister, for example. And then please specify your concern. Hindi yung, dear sir, pwede po bang magtanong? O di ba? You know that the effort that you're about to send the email and it will be read by the person, eh di sana nilagay mo na yung tanong mo, di ba? So may I ask a question? This is my concern, blah, 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 blah so that it would be answered promptly, all right? Thumbs up if that's clear. Lalo na sa mga guilty na pati doon sa title or about the email, doon kayo nagme-message, di ba? So please do this. And represent well and uplift the image of the university and RPC. And as early as now, I would like to congratulate the student council of our school because we're the first one to, to really um, facilitate this virtual acquaintance party. So please, let's give a virtual clap to our student council officers together with their advisors. Okay, please unmute and say, Mahusay, sabay-sabay. Mahusay. So please, let's continue to be pioneer, not only in our schools, but also in our university. And let's um, share these best fit practices to other schools through your governor, Mr. Rico Reni Boy, who's really active in these activities. Congratulations. So I have decided for me to be able to reach out to you and for you to be able to talk to me. I am deciding to come up with an e-consultation and e-conversation for me to be able to get to know you more and for you to feel like the office of the dean is not actually an office for you to feel afraid. Like, I si Dean. Or for example, nahihiya ko kay Dean. So, gusto ko pong ilapit ang aming tanggapan sa inyong lahat. So, we will be having a Dean's Hour that will be at 10 o'clock to 11 every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Please take a screenshot of this. For you to be able to express your concerns specifically to me, then please attend this consultation as is scheduled. Mr. Rene Rico, am I still being heard? Okay. And so, uh, without much ado, welcome faculty and learners to Academic Year 2021 and 2022. And we're happy to be with you in the whole RPC family. Maraming salamat.
Thank you so much, Dr. Virgo. And now, for our closing remarks, may I call Randy Boy Rico to give him a virtual clap, please. Hi, are you still here? Is everyone still here? Yeah. In behalf of the RPC Student Council, uh, we would like to thank, um, of course, our president, uh, Dr. Rhonda Padilla, and Dr. Ingel Rupasag, as well as our dean, Dr. Virgo Lopez. Um, all of our teaching force at Penn Pacific University, thank you so much. And our warmest gratitude to everyone. Before this day ends, uh, allow me as well to give credit to my fellow officers at RP Student Council, Kyrie, of course, Edmar, Eric, Mark, Lawrence, Beverly, and Abigail. You guys are really amazing. Um, of course, to our RPC advisors, Sir Rene and Sir Derek, thank you so much, sir. Um, and finally, to all of the students, especially to our uh, freshman students who participated and joined us today, the, uh, this day may not be possible without you. So congratulations, everyone. And I hope that this will be a good start with our stay at Pan Pacific U. Again, good afternoon and thank you to all of us. God bless. Okay. Thank you so much to our governor, Rennie Boy Rico. So this time, may I request everyone to please open their cam for our picture session. Okay, please open their camera. Okay, are you guys ready? Ready na ba? Okay, so Miss Beverly, mag ano ka rin, ah, picture your documentation. So, in three, two, one, smile. Okay, thank you so much, everyone. Okay, so that's the end of our program. But before that, please accomplish the evaluation form for the virtual acquaintance, a glimpse of the new faces. Link was sent in the chat box, so kindly check it out. Okay, so let's have the evaluation form. Wait, Edmar. Okay, so Mark already sent the evaluation form. Kikita nyo ba, guys? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So please be reminded that your response will be the basis for the issuance of a certificate of participation. So, of course, before we leave, let's now listen to our PCSD loyalty song.
Okay, thank you so much for attending to our event today. Hope to see you soon again soon. Also, uh, good luck on your uh, for this school year. So thank you so much. Goodbye.